it is getting seemingly worse every day for Mel Gibson. There's another audio recording which has now been made public, reportedly of him and his former girlfriend, and it is filled with threats of violence against her. CBS News correspondent Ben Tracy has the latest. Listen to my f***ing ranting. Listen to what you do to me. That is how Mel Gibson began his more than eight-minute long rant, posted Monday by RadarOnline.com. In it, the actor sounds completely unhinged, threatening his ex-girlfriend Oksana Grigorieva during a phone call she apparently recorded. You need medication. I need a woman! I don't need medication. You need a f***ing bat in the side of the head. How about that? 40-year-old Grigori Eva is trying to get custody of their eight-month-old daughter. She filed a complaint with police last week that launched a domestic violence investigation against the 54-year-old actor. In the recording, Grigori Eva says Gibson punched her in the face. We were hitting a woman with a child in her hands. You, what kind of men is that? Hitting a woman when she's holding a child in her hand, breaking her teeth twice in the face. What kind of men is that? Mm, oh, you're all angry now. You're going to get to, you know what? You're going to answer one day, boy, you're going to answer. I'll put you in a rose garden, you You understand that? Because I'm capable of it. You understand that? At one point, the actor gets so worked up, he's left gasping for air. Gibson was once a high-flying action hero, but now it's his career that's going up in flames. The actor's longtime talent agency dropped him last week after another expletive-filled recording surfaced. Almost anybody with an ounce of compassion is offended by this man right now, and nobody in Hollywood wants to be the one to say, yeah, I'll be in business with him. So that's why I'm so angry, because I don't have any friends. The career is over. A hard truth even Gibson seems to understand. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Los Angeles. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.